What's up, everyone? This is not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor, so don't base anything I say out these videos. I'm just doing it for pure entertainment purposes only. Want to jump in, kind of go over a couple things, man. Send a little positive light. I know there's a lot of FUD, a lot of negativity, a lot of people talking about bankruptcy, a lot of people talking about AMC is failing, and it's just not true. I don't know what else to say. Um, one of the big things a lot of people have been talking about, uh, short interest is definitely up. Short interest is at 19%. Um, so if you go back to like when we had the, the little squeeze, I don't know what you'd call it, back, but back in, uh, June of 2021, when we had that nice little run to 72, um, I, short interest is around 15%. We're at 19% now. So even if you include dilution that, that is being done or has just got done, um, you're probably still going to be around 16% short interest. So, and it's going to continue to go up. They're, they're just, they're stuck. They keep having to, to add. I don't think they necessarily want to. I think they just have to at this point. Um, um, but yeah, I mean, AMC, as far as a business, they're making more, um, now, um, than they were. Obviously there was pandemic, there was trouble in the box office. You know, you can go back and look the, the daily box office is, is up. Um, obviously there's more movies coming out. There's more bright side to come than there was then. Um, if you look at the OBV, there's definitely more buys, um, than there is sales. Institutions are increasing their positions. Now that's huge right there. The institutions increasing their positions and not lowering, um, the percentage of that. I don't know the exact percentage, but it's pretty high. A lot more buys and sales, um, going on there. So that's something to really look at. You know, the institutions, why would they be buying heavy if they thought, you know, this thing was going to go down. Um, a lot of us, you know, a lot of the people that are listening to the narrative and spreading hate and FUD that aren't shills or aren't paid, that are just wanting to troll, just let them troll, you know? And what else can you do? It's really not worth your mental health or your stress or your argument. It's not worth your breath. Let them troll. Let them be broke. Whatever. You know, even if they're rich and they're trolling, just does it really matter? No, it doesn't. Just let them talk their talk. People are going to talk to you no matter what. So, um, sorry, I got text messages throwing me off here. Wife telling me to go home and pick weeds. Damn. <laughs> this video was going to be awesome. Now I got to go home and pick goat heads. Um, anyways, uh, anyways, yeah, let's get back on track. Stupid weeds. We're going to be, uh, speaking of weeds, Sundial, I'm in that stock. Uh, I bought back in a couple days ago. Doing good. Totally off subject. Uh, AMC has cut debt, uh, Nearly by, what, a billion, I think? I'm trying to look at my notes here. Yeah, they had uh, around June 2021, I think it was around $5.2 billion in debt. Right now we're sitting at $4.5 billion. Um, the other thing is you got to look at all the other businesses that are bringing income that, that we didn't have back then when we had that nice little jump. Um, you know, the popcorn, the candy, the movie distribution, the credit cards, the gold and then the R Hills, HYMC's running and doing better. Um, there's just a lot of, a lot of stuff going on that, that, that people don't want to hear, you know, they're like too focused tunnel vision on, you know, movies are done, AMC, Adam Aaron, da, 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 da. And, and, you know, the dilution has helped move us through slow times, but there's definitely more money being made more opportunity to make money. There's more movies coming out. The potential of this business is is very high at this point, much higher than it was when it even squeezed back then. So um, I do believe we're in for a good um, next few months, probably in the next, like I, I, I've been saying it for a long time, uh, for, for about a half a year, I've been saying a year and a half to two years. So now I think we're a year to a year and a half away before we see some nice, nice movement. Um, so I don't know, man, that's just my thoughts on it. Have a good day. Be blessed and stay positive.